Located in the Upper Aberdeen Chardee, the Guernic Burn is a long-term monitoring site for spring-run Atlantic salmon populations. Operating since 1966, it is Scotland's longest-running comprehensive study of salmon populations. The site includes an upstream and downstream trap that catch adult salmon returning to the stream to spawn and juvenile salmon migrating to sea. During the summer of 2016, the juvenile trap was completely refurbished with much of the timber structure replaced. The trap refurbishment was completed in time for autumn when adult fish enter the Guernic to spawn and a downstream migration of juvenile salmon takes place. Autumn is a challenging time at the Guernic, as leaves from the trees upstream of the trap can block the screens, causing the trap to overflow. To prevent the trap from spilling, regular cleaning is required. Wooden boards can be added or removed from the trap to adjust the amount of water that is sieved through the screens, allowing it to catch fish at a range of water levels. Juvenile fish emigrating downstream pass over the fiberglass screens and into the trough where they are directed into a large holding box. There are two distinct periods of downstream migration at the Guernic, one in spring and one in autumn. Fish migrating downstream in autumn spend the winter in the River Dee before entering the sea the following year. As many as 5,000 juvenile salmon can be caught in the trap over the spring and autumn runs. Fish are netted out of the trap and information on their length, age and sex can be recorded. Along with Atlantic salmon, brown trout and European eels are also caught in the downstream trap. The upstream trap catches adult salmon returning from the sea to spawn. Adult salmon enter the River Dee in spring and spend several months moving up river. The adult trap also requires regular cleaning to ensure it is operating efficiently. Adult salmon enter the Guernic Burn to spawn during higher flows typically in October and November. The adult screens direct the salmon towards the holding box where they enter the trap through an inscale. Once inside, they cannot easily find their way out and staff visit the trap regularly to check for adult fish.
the adult salmon are netted out, and details on their length, weight and sex are recorded. Tissue samples are taken for genetic studies, and a sample of scales is removed from each fish to determine their age. After processing, the adult salmon are released upstream to continue on with their journey. Spawning in the Guernic Burn is usually complete by mid-November, and adult fish are often caught in the descending trap after spawning. These fish, known as kelts, are released downstream and some will make their way back to sea. <laughs>